so guys the length of the fabric we'll be using for this tutorial is 60 inches long and for the width is 50 inches wide also note that the fabric i am using right now is a stretchy fabric so we won't be adding any sewing allowance to our measurements so now i'll go ahead and fold the fabric into four um, you guys always check for the um, wrong side of your fabric and make sure you fold the wrong side of your fabric because that's where we'll be checking our measurement on so you fold into two and then you fold into four now i will go ahead and take points first is already the shoulder point so that is already there um, then next is my bust point and then my waist point and then the hip point <music> Also guys, I like to chalk the middle of the fabric so that I can be able to get an accurate and straight line. So go ahead and do just that so you can rule your line and get a straight line. Now divide all measurements by 4 and then chalk them down on each point you divide your round bust your round waist your round hip and then you chalk each and every one of those measurements on their points ahead now and connect all points together remember guys there is no sewing allowance we're not adding any sewing allowance to this because this is stretchy fabric so i'm just gonna cut according to my measurement when i get to the base i will just go ahead and extend the line because i want my dress to be free at the base so i'll just extend the line no measurement there just use your ruler and just extend the line extra two to three inches or even more for this dress, we'll be cutting our sleeves together with the dress. So right now, I'll go ahead and take my sleeves measurements from the neck point where our neck is going to be seated. I'll be taking 20 inches from that point. You guys, note that the front and the back piece of this dress are together right now. That is why we folded the fabric into four. We're cutting the both of them together. So now taking the neckline for the back piece and the front piece. For the width, I'll be taking three inches. Now for the depth of the front neckline, I'll be taking 3 inches deep. And for the back neckline, I'll be taking 1 inch, one inch deep. So go ahead now and connect points together on the neckline. And now I'll be cutting out just the back neckline. And once we are done joining, I'll be cutting out the front neckline. <music> From the bust line from where our bust is sitting from the line i'll be pulling a straight line connecting it to the shoulder points um from the 20 inches we took i'll be connecting both points together for the armhole so i'll gradually connect this to the measurement i have for my round bust so now i'll go ahead and cut this out so you guys can be able to see the sleeves connected to the dress and how the dress looks so go ahead and measure out what your round um, elbow is because that is where the sleeve is going to be stopping so measure out what you have for your round elbow divide by two and then chop that at the base of the sleeves and then connect that point to where your boss points that's the line where your boss point is sitting connect that point there this is done we'll go ahead now and take this to our machine and join by half an inch you guys remember just to 
join by half an inch because we did not add any sewing allowance to this so we'll be taking out just half an inch from this So after all this is done, after joining by half an inch, I'll go right ahead and cut out the front neckline. Remember where I chopped by 3 inches deep for the front neckline, I'll be cutting this out. You guys, this is the fabric I'll be pleating on my dress. This fabric is 10 inches long and 60 inches wide. So I'll be pleating this fabric round my dress. <music> So guys, I am done with the pleats. This is how it looks. I am done using that fabric to pleat around my dress. This is the outcome. So now I'll go ahead now and cut out an excess fabric that is twice my waist, my round waist. I want to use that for my band. I'll be attaching that to my waist. And also for the sleeve too, I'll be cutting out fabric, excess fabric that is twice my round elbow. And then I'll be attaching this to the base of my sleeves. You guys, for the band, the width for the band, how wide it is, is 10 inches. Then folded into two, each is 5 inches. And then for the sleeves, I cut out 4 inches. So when folded into two, you get 2 inches. So you guys, this is it. This is the outcome of the dress. Please, if you're watching me for the first time, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And also comment on the comment section below if you like this video. So that I can be doing more of these videos, you guys. So, and if you have not subscribed to my channel, go right ahead and click on the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. I'll be seeing you in my next video. Bye.